So Lumut is a curious place. It's very small, you know, and probably only exists because of the ferries to some of the islands here. I mean, there's not only Pankor, there's a couple of more, but yeah, I don't know much about them. Uh, people who come here get get on a ferry to Pankor, uh, <clears throat> which is mainly a, a, a Malay clientele. And when I say Malay, I mean Malay, not like Malaysians. I mean, I haven't, uh, the guests I've seen here, the, the tourists or the weekend dwellers or whatever they called, they're Malays, you know, like, interesting, you know, like women with scarves and not Chinese, not Indian, but well, probably there are some too, but you know what I mean, you know, it's mainly. So uh, even last time I was here, some two, two and a half years ago, it was like that. It's interesting, see? And I yeah, just walked out of the town center a bit to see, to show you a bit the esplanade. See, that's where the boats land. You know, it's cool, it's, it's actually, yeah, it's pretty nice. It's still morning, not super early. Good morning, sir. You're catching anything? Fish? Ikan? Ikan. <laughs> yeah, um, and see, this is like an exercise area. There's just a big park along, there's, there's a few, um, Playgrounds are pretty well equipped, so people come here, just not uh, Western tourists. And don't tell me, yes, I know, but I've been there too, and I'm a Westerner. Yeah, I'm, of course, you, there are some Westerners, but it's just not, not so many. And it's quite peaceful. Yeah, we just had some breakfast, some roti chanai, which is good too. And it's still peaceful. There's some other vloggers, some speeder. Hello. Morning. Hello. Morning. You are vloggers? No, just making some assignments. Assignment? A uh, movie? No, no, no. Uh, for, a photograph. A video resume. Ah, for what? Uh, for um, uh, what university? university. Ah. Uh, ah, you have to apply for university? Or? Yeah, yes, yes. Ah, and you have to send in a video? Yes. Ah, okay. All right. Good, good luck day. with that. You too. Bye bye. Cheers. Bye. See, and um, the thing is, uh, the water here is okay, but there's some industries. So it's pretty similar like to, to, to Penang. It's clearer now. But see there? I don't know what they're doing, but there's industries. See that? I don't know if you, with this camera, if you can see far, there are lots of cranes and some drilling going on. I don't know if, there, if there's oil here or there's still copper or if they're producing things. But anyway, just I want to show a little bit of that uh, esplanade, which is quiet, you know, because it's still morning. Because I went out last night for a, a little walk and, uh, and it, was not, it was a bit late and there was lots of people outside, you know, and, and it was like midnight, even kids. So as you, you often see kids here awaken midnight or one in the morning and it's nothing out of the ordinary <sighs> made me feel like a, a little bit like being in Egypt uh, I used to live in Egypt in Cairo and it was yeah in Cairo doing summertime anyway see it's quiet and it goes on and on but I'm gonna go back into town and show a little bit of it. So now I'm uh, back in the center of the town, village, city, no, not city. <laughs> Sometimes difficult to say. See, the barber shop is open. He's waiting for business. And also the lottery shop is open. Hello. <laughs> See, there's lots of shops that are open. Some shops are still closed, you know. And shops like this, you find everywhere in this town. You know, like these bilis, uh, anchovy, dried fish that the Malays and the Indonesians love so much. So if you, if you want uh, anchovies, dried anchovies, you come right here. The best in town, right? Yes, see? And then we have, yeah, some more of these shops, you know, with dried squid and fish, you know? Lots of that around here. Squid, fish, you know, 
we've got lots of it. Actually, when I say lots of it, I mean lots of it. Hello sir, I'm just showing the world your anchovies. <laughs> your ikan bilis. <laughs> Hello ladies. See, this is amazing. <laughs> Another shop. You cannot eat so many dried fish like they sell here in this town. So amazing. See, even uh, dried, uh, what's one of these, uh, shells? Squid, see, they look like aliens. A lot like aliens. Maybe they are aliens. We don't know that. And these are, these are actually flies. That's just disgusting. <laughs> see, you can buy some, sh um, some shirts, you know, from Punker Island, you know. You don't even have to go to Punker Island. You can just buy the shirt here. And some, sh um, some dried fish. And what do we have here? Some more dried fish. A whole shop of it. Isn't that amazing? And the next shop. <laughs> dried fish. More dried fish. Hello. Beautiful fish. See? We know one thing now for sure. That the Malays love their dried fish. So it's Saturday. It's quite, it's a lot of people. Not like I mean like extremely much but well actually there was a lot of people here last night when we got here but you know it's like lunchtime so maybe a lot of people are doing excursions or they're on the island or they're at home eating you can find here some some restaurants some small eating places where whole family I've eaten here before it's very good you know prices are all right they're not the cheapest in town but, you know, what you're gonna do is it's a, it's a holiday place. See, lots of more dried fish. A lot more dry fish. Wow, so much dry fish. Hello. Hello, hello. See, here more, more. See, I kid you not. This town contains all the dried fish that a whole nation needs. See, more and more and more and more. It's amazing. So much dried fish. So much dried fish, huh? It's amazing. <laughs> See? Squid. And then you have some food here. Actually, this is where I'll have lunch. Maybe. Or tomorrow. Maybe today. Wow, oh, fried chicken. Looks good. Wow. Um, <laughs> I am goreng. Yes, I'm learning. I'm learning. See? There's lots of people here. Not much of the the old social distancing being celebrated around these parts actually yesterday on the bus we 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 passed some uh, kampong a village and it was a big mosque and it was friday of course there and, and it just just uh, what an afternoon prayers were just done and there was like literally hundreds of people you know streaming out of the mosque some of them have masks but it's not like definitely not what i would call a uh, of the old social distancing. See? The ice cream vendor? Oh. Vendors? I'm not sure. See, our oh, people, this is the, where they queue up for the ferry to Pankow. I think. They think, they all, they, they, they all think that, like, that bastard foreigner is cutting in line. But I'm not cutting in line, I'm just filming a little bit. Ah, this is the expert ferry, huh? Are uh, this for Panko? Yeah. Panko yeah. Island. And these two? No, no, only one. Only one counter. And this is a different place? Or? No, close. Ah, it's just close? Yes. Ah, uh, but normally they also have a ferry. Yeah. Ah, okay. You can uh, also London. No, no. I go Monday. No, Monday. Go Monday. Less people, I think. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy the You too. Bye-bye. Take care. Okay, see? Weekend? Of course, lots of people only have the weekend. So, and then you come for the weekend. You would you pack your family, get... Get tickets. I would go very early, but you know. See, here also they sell lots of souvenirs, hats. Of course, hats are always a good thing. They protect you from the sun. And, yeah, basically from the sun. Yeah, see? Oh, we saw that. Oh, let's check out just the pier a little bit. Uh, see, there are these, oh, I forget what they're called. They're not army, they're. TLM or something. But there's a there's not too much social distancing going on. 
I see there's a fairy right now. The rocks are fairy. I say fairy, right? You, I say fairy. You thinking, oh, fairy, you know? Like, but they're like speedboats. They're, they're pretty rapid fairies. Here again, lots of boats. Maybe you can actually charter some of them as well. You know, there's a little beach here, but of course, that's not the bathing kind. Actually, today, just you know, maybe a couple hours ago, I met at the park. I met the, this guy. He's a German guy. So and he he's been here like for three or four months. He's been here alone uh, during the whole lockdown area. You know, whole whole. Lo so so and there, there was no one here. There's a hostel apparently. I didn't even see there's a hostel. But and so I stayed there, and he was all alone. You know, but he could go out. You know, because of course there's no. No, staying inside if you if you if you're alone in a place. I mean, even literally, there's no one here. So I would have loved to experience that if possible. See, that's why people park their cars. And yeah, you get the ticket there, right? And then you go in here. Hello, sir. Yes. Just um. Yeah, yeah. I go tomorrow. Oh, maybe uh, yeah. Monday. But I just film a little bit, okay? Looky, looky. Looky, looky. Okay. Yes, thank you. See, and if you're thirsty. If you're here and you're thirsty, that's where you go. At uh, two thirty and two, yeah, they're a bit expensive. <laughs> Sometimes you get them for one ringgit. Yes, yeah, I can. Oh no, I'll just go back. I'll just film a little. But I put on my mask. Just, just, just looking. I go tomorrow. Yeah, excuse me, sir. Hello. Yes, yes, of course, of course. But I'm not going in now. I Why? go tomorrow because tomorrow. too many people. I think tomorrow or Monday much better. Uh, yeah. Yeah, less people. Yeah, less. Huh. And now it's um, duty free. It's true. Yeah, duty free. Uh, that's good. Now more people go. Face uh, mask. Face mask. I'll put on my face mask. You're not going today. No, no. Monday. Bye. Yeah. Okay, bye bye. Bye. See you Monday. Alright. Okay, so I'm wearing my mask. <laughs> but I'm not going in. Why am I wearing my mask? So, do you want to see that? That building where you sit, you know? You can sit here, you know, it's great, you know? You can just imagine yourself sitting down here, waiting for the next boat, you know? Maybe smoking a cigarette. Now that's that Tilarang Meroko. That's illegal. Well, you can have, a, you can have an overpri overpriced soda, you know, from that machine. You'll be okay. Anyway, oh my God, I'll take that mask off again because there's no one here. In fact, in almost nobody, you know, some people wear a mask. Anyway, yeah, this is, yeah. Yeah, don't come on the weekend. Also, of course, uh, depends where you go, but of course, weekends, uh, the places uh, on, on Punker Island, uh, you know, they're full, you know. You might not get a room, and you want the room, right? So yeah, and last time we also we came on a on a Monday, and then we negotiated a good deal for a week. And we got like for, for seven, 70 ringgit, like a big family room, right at the beach. So it's not so bad, but yeah, it's a bit pricey, especially since the island got you know more known. This is because the the government wants this to be a tourist island. That's why they made it a duty free place. You know, so. Because this is new, this has just started uh, before the lockdown. That means basically you can go over there, you know, and buy lots of cheap alcohol and cigarettes and chocolate, you know, and get drunk and fat with the chocolate, you know. Uh, <laughs> but of, of course, it does attract more visitors. Not Muslims, of course. No, I don't know if that's true. Anyway, yeah, this is just a. Yeah, it's. I mean, here is still here is still quiet. I think there'll be more, uh, a lot more people out in the afternoon. There's a another beach, but it's not a bathing beach because you know this industries. It's like oily. The water is oily. Let's just walk here a little bit. Last time I was here, I saw a fish otter, which was kind of exciting, you know, because I've never seen a fish otter outside the zoo. See. It's not so bad. And there's a there's a little market. You wanna, you wanna go there and check it out? Yeah. I'll make another video of the surroundings. And yeah, the, yeah, last night, no, in the afternoon it was full of people here. I thought I'm gonna be filming lots of people. But maybe yeah, tonight I'll go 
bit further, maybe film, you know, the local people having fun. And saying local people, they're not local people, of course, because there's not a lot of people here. They come from all over, but yeah, it's mainly Malay, which is interesting. The market. Now, this is where we stayed last time. But yeah, this just took online bookings. It's actually a fact now. Online booking makes you a better person. What well, fuck? It doesn't. I wish more people, you know, went back to old school, you know, like you walking around, asking around, negotiating. That was so much more fun. But nowadays, it depends on the place, you know. You show up, man, see how much the room is there. The other bookings are. So that dude, I don't have a booking, you know, I don't book online, you know, I'm not one of those people. I say, oh, sorry, sir, you know, only booking. See, fuck! But yeah, you'll find something. And it's always gonna be cheaper. And yeah, not gonna meet too many tourists or Westerners there. I mean, it depends if you want to see Westerners. I don't mind seeing Westerners, you know, sometimes. But I prefer, you know, to meet more local people. That's why I travel, right? Anyway, hey, there's even a KFC here. What more do you want? There's a Nazi Kantar place, you know? You don't need that anymore, that KFC. Anyway, okay, uh, I'm going to upload this, show it to the city of it, and then uh, tomorrow, or the day after tomorrow, we head over to that island, and I'll show you a bit of beach life, and a bit of monkey life. And the good thing is they have a, they have hornbills there, a lot of hornbills everywhere. So I'll show you that, okay? And yeah, that's it. You guys take care, huh? Be good. Go to the beach or anywhere. Bye bye.